what's happening with Rohit Sharma, guys? Uh, he was dropped on 15. Again, let, let's look at this. He started in an attacking manner, like the way he is going to attack. And that's how he's been batting for the last 12 months. Let's be very honest about it. Um, he's attacking, got dropped, and then just short pe wo out. Hue hai. He was trying, it was a short, short of land delivery. He was trying to get into position to again pull it, pulled out mm -hmm. of, at the last moment and caught at second slip. Nitin, what was that shot really? What what happened there? He's getting he's getting opened up too often, isn't it? I mean, yeah, uh, yeah. for a bat for a batter of that experience and that caliber, uh, he gets opened out too often. Uh, Tim Saudi opened him up in Pune. Uh, yeah. Here here again, Matt Henry. Uh, that again, the T Twenty mindset. Uh, he, if you look at if you look at his uh, batting performance uh, since that Adelaide semi final where he almost. Uh, made a plea to everybody that you know we can't be so timid but yeah. that was t20 cricket in test yeah. cricket it's okay and 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 when if, if you've seen he's batted about what 33 times today after that adelaide semi-final mm. uh, and he's faced over 50 balls only 12 times yeah. um, which you know which it just doesn't all go well for uh, for a guy who yeah if you see what he did in england in 2021 uh, yeah. Left deliveries, batted out time, mm. uh, you know, wore the wore the bowlers down. Here mm. it seems he just isn't willing to do that, and I don't know what's what's really gone wrong. And I think it's time for some hard yeah. chats with him, uh, you know, well, about the approach. Yeah, I mean, um, we were talking about this in the you know aftermath of the previous Test match, uh, Nitin or K. Shrinivas Rao, the group sports editor, was there on the show, mm. and he said, you know what? With BGT on the horizon, it's just too late to have those chats. Now it's ab aapko us series mein jana hi hai. We'll also bring the Virat Kohli angle in this just a bit. But Gopayan, uh, here, here's a comment, and this is not me commenting. <laughs> uh, my name's sake here. When Rohit elevates his white ball game, his red ball game takes a hit. And and I Hang think uh, yeah, I think that's that's a very valid comment. However, in the England series this year, he did score two hundreds. Lekin uske baad aap dekho IPL mein unka game dip ho gaya. You know, and 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 I don't think post the IPL, wo balance up aya hai. Even in the T20 World Cup, we we were getting cameos, but that was T20 format, so you can't really judge there, can you? The kind of touch he has, the kind of scoring he has, and Nitin has a great point that you look at the kind of clutch knocks he's played in England. Ab last year Nagpur Test ki baat kar lo, the one he played against Australia, you're seeing those kind of clutch knocks from Rohit. So let's be honest here. You know, we have, uh, because uh, Dupayan, you said that Ashwin is towards the fag end of his career. But we are also talking about a 37 year old batter. I was just thinking, like you said, he's getting opened up a bit, Nitin. So Rohit Sharma is 37. That is when your reflexes are starting to slow down. That is when these type of dismissals become more and more regular. So are we seeing. The slowing down of reflexes of Rohit Sharma on the bigger stage, and this is now just going to keep happening. See, uh, Ro Rohit Sharma, much like Virendra Sehwag, also he's a hand-eye coordination player. Uh, like okay. he, he, and as he's grow growing old, uh, see yeah. this hand-eye coordination starts taking a slight hit. It it happens. Like he is yeah. not a grammatically perfect player. He has never been. But uh, it's his Lazy magnificent, uh, uh, it is magnificent hand-eye coordination that made him the player that he is. Mm -hmm. But now, as Nitin was rightly saying, and he's and, the, and that according to that comment, he's playing white ball to white ball to white ball. You know mm -hmm. what? Like what I feel was very important for Rohit Sharma is that he should have cut down on his vacation and played some red ball. That Dulip Trophy uh, <laughs> that they played. Rohit Sharma is one player who should have played that. He should have understood that he is slightly undercooked, uh, and mm. red ball runs are not happening for him. Like yeah. I, I, I do not want to undermine the greatness of Rohit Sharma, and I myself am a great fan of Rohit Sharma. I really love his batting. But but, but the point is, you have to be honest, is, right? Is Thirty-seven years old. Yeah. Yeah, this is yeah. happening. This is happening, and is that when when hand-eye coordination starts taking a hit, 
then you will have to put in that extra. Even Sachin Tendulkar, before playing his last test, he turns up at Lali on that yeah. very difficult pitch and scores at 74 and helps Bombay win. So yeah. that was that was that was the preparation of Tendulkar. So there is you know, why should uh, the, these players who are who are great in their own right not do that preparation? It it is it is a valid preparation that they should do, especially when you are going into that phase where you have to win five test matches to qualify for the World Test Championship final. Don't yeah. take uh, they are taking slightly slightly taking things for granted. And this mm. beating Bangladesh, etc. I don't know. Like it's it's probably hubris, bolte na. Where was she? Yeah, thoda sa. Because I mean, the the there was a lot of uh, discussion with the way we won in Kanpur. Let's be honest. Bangladesh were on the back foot. Ham nahi dala tha, but they were on the back foot, and you know things just clicked in that particular match. And again, um, Bangladesh aren't the best of test oppositions or any kind of opposition for India in across formats. Uh, on the rarest of occasions, Bangladesh have done well against India.